So all of the hollow blue right now is in response to us finding maybe established the, for the first time in North America, the Asian giant hornet, Vespa mandarinia. They're one of the largest hornets that we have on the planet. And, and so that's what makes them so unusual and, and makes them so uh, striking uh, to people. They do not occur here in North America. They're native to the Pacific Rim of Southeast Asia. Um, where they do occur, they're, they're voracious predators of honeybees. Our biggest fear is that it will uh, actually impact small beekeepers and maybe drive them out of business and raise costs for larger beekeepers. It's just something we don't want to see happen. In like Japan, um, it does cause a, a mortality factor among humans just because they're so large. And if, if someone stumbles across a, a nest and you get stung by it, a few of these hornets, it, 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 can, it can cause serious health concerns, especially if, if, if someone is uh, allergic to, to these types of stings. Being the biggest hornet also has a really big stinger, and that stinger can punch right through a regular beekeeping suit. In fact, the, the man who destroyed the nest up in Nanaimo, British Columbia, was stung multiple times and described it as, as, as hot thumbtacks being driven into his skin, so ouch. It has such a long stinger that our uh, the, the suits that we normally use for beekeepers, it, it's not adequate. And so, so they're, they're going to be well protected when they go in and try and navigate any nests that they may find.